the kitchen this morning serving up a tasty treat for mom. Mother's Day is Sunday and a great way to show mom how much she means to you is to get her out of the kitchen <laughs> and you to fix the meal. This morning Chef Becky is rolling up a tasty recipe and she's also whipping up a special drink to celebrate that special mom in your life. Hi everyone, I'm Chef Becky. Mother's Day is right around the corner and I'm going to help you get ready. Today we're going to make my ham and cheese crescent roll-ups. This recipe is going to knock her socks off. So here I have three ounces of cream cheese. I really like Nancy's cream cheese because it's local and it does not have any added thickeners. So it's soft and easy to use straight out of the fridge. So three ounces is a little less than half a cup. And I'm going to add the minced green onions. This is extra sharp cheddar cheese. We use about two teaspoons of stone ground mustard. Now stir that up. I really like this recipe. It's so versatile. You could substitute bacon and Swiss cheese if you like. I think this looks like it's ready. It's well thoroughly combined. So for this recipe I'm going to try something new. I found these pre-cut sheets of parchment paper. It's a little large for my cookie sheet but this overhang is no big deal. So here I have one eight ounce tube of crescent roll dough. And even though I know it's going to startle me, it just, oh, it does it every time. So the crescent roll dough is perforated into these triangles. So I'm just going to separate them. I'm going to put about one tablespoon of the seasoned cheese mixture on each triangle. Now I have served this cheese filling with crackers and it's great all by itself. Now I like to use a silicone spreader so it, it, because it's nice and flexible and it won't tear the dough. I just carefully spread it out into an even layer. So now I'm going to put one slice of ham on each roll-up and I like the round shape for this recipe. I'm going to put it about like that. So now it's time to roll them up. I'm rolling these just loosely. You don't want to roll them too tightly because then the dough in the middle won't get cooked through. And I really like how the ham shows on the outside. I'm placing these point side down on the parchment because they won't explode and come undone while they're baking because they will puff up. So now these roll-ups are ready to go in the oven. My oven's set to 350 degrees and they'll bake for 20 minutes. So while our crescent roll-ups are baking, I'm going to show you a special drink. Moms deserve pampering every day of the year, but today we need to go all out. I'm going to show you how to make the Cinderella. So for this recipe, I'm going to use a glass measuring cup. That's half a cup of orange juice. And I'm adding half a cup of pineapple juice, one quarter cup of ginger ale to give it some fizz, and one quarter cup of fresh lemon juice. Now I'm adding two tablespoons of grenadine to make it pink and sweeten it up. We need to get about a cup of ice in our martini shaker. So now I'm going to pour our juices into the cocktail shaker. I'm going to give it a gentle shake. So now these are going to get a fresh orange slice to hang on the side of the glass. See I have the little cut in there. And if you have it, serve it with a paper umbrella to make it really special. Now our crescent rolls are ready to come out of the oven. These smell so good and they're a nice golden color. They're still pretty hot, but I think it's safe to go ahead and plate them up. So today we learned two awesome recipes for Mother's Day. Here we have my ham and cream cheese roll-ups. And here we have the Cinderella. It's the perfect way to treat your mom on Mother's Day. Happy Mother's Day. Yummo. It's so good. She oh, was, so you good. were just asking me, are they good? They are so good <laughs> hot. They're good warm. And quite frankly, they're, they're good, good cold. cold. So that's they're a good, good recipe. Yes. Yeah. Very good. And that drink is super tasty. And I of bet course, it's tasty. you could add you could to add it. A, yeah whatever you like, yes. but um, you know, the non-alcoholic version of it is very, very tasty as Yummy. well. Well, there you go. You can spoil mom this weekend. That's right. If you'd like the recipe for ham and cheese roll-ups and the Cinderella, you can head to KMTR.com, click on the KMTR TV tab right there on our homepage, and then click on news links. And of course, you can also find Chef Becky on Facebook.